Okay, Cheyenne, we're going to begin by looking at Caitlin Lowe. Uh, these are pictures when you first started, and you see I've drawn a red circle around how she continues with her hands back in the bat up, and you can see yours, how your, your bat angle drops, and that's the thing that we're working on, and that's the thing that we're starting to get a little bit better at. So we want to um, be able to keep our hands back, bat not dropping and then that puts us on a better angle to have the impact out in front of us and you can see how she impacts out in front that little check mark you can see is how your bat flips and you roll too early and then the next picture you'll see her extending through the ball it's just like hitting from the right side we got to be able to extend and uh, we got to do that when we slap hit as well so Extending through, it's not natural from, especially when you switch over to that side, you want to, at the point of impact, you want to flip your bat, and uh, certainly we've got to get better at that. So here we go. Here's you coming. It's not bad. You see how you're able to keep your hands back and bat up? And um, now, right here, you can see where your hands are and your bat's dropped at that point, but you're trying to make impact out in front of you which is a in a better place and um, you get really good from there and then you roll just a little bit you can see your bat head coming up above your hands and you flip it through we want to extend and roll much later in the swing and I'll try to show it to you a little bit better right here so you come you see how your bat head drops backwards uh, we really want to pull Harder. You see where your hands are? Well, our hands should be more out in front of us. And I'll draw you another circle. You see that red line is how we want to pull the bat. And the second circle is our hands out in front of us. That's the angle that we want to take rather than um, letting that bat head drop and flatten out. So here we go. Your hands are back and up. And... Uh, you want to hit the ball out in front of you. Of course, that's a little bit of a low pitch, but we want to be much more firm and in command and attitude. You'll hear me say attitude quite a bit. So here we slap bunt. And you see how your bat comes back? You know, sometimes you talk about bunt and you want to catch the ball, but in slap hitting and when we're drag bunting, we want to be firm with that top hand right here. Much better. And you see how firm you are. The bat's not being knocked out of your hands. And you can do what you want to with the ball. So your hand comes higher up on the bat, bat head. And then you're much firmer. You think about that, that back hand or top hand being really firm and in command. And those last two right there look really good. Um, that's being in command of the bat and putting the ball where you want it to be. And that's what I call button with attitude. Uh, once again, you go, your hands are back, your bat's up, your toes down the third baseline. You're still looking good as you cross over. Your hands are still backing up. Now your hands are pulling hard uh, diagonally, which is what we're talking about. Your hands are perfect right here as you hit the ball out in front of you. I, I love where you're at right here. You can see that you're, where your hands are, and in the red line, you're hitting the ball out in front. And uh, maybe just a little bit soft right there, but a much better bat angle and a much better point of impact. And uh, here we go again. You, you dropped your bat head just a little bit on this, but much better. You, you can see that your hands are out in front of you and you're a lot more firm with the bat. And there you did it again right there. It's still a little bit soft, but it's much more in control and a nice firm slap. You see how much better your bat is in this position than when you used to drop it. You see how your hands are out in front of you and in a very powerful position. But then you flip right there, or that little roll right there is very weak. And, and often it causes you to flip across the top of it, which you want to be on top of it when you slap. But um, right when you're at the impact where you can do what you want to with it, you're flipping across the top. Look good again, hands out in front, much better angle, and then just a little bit of early uh, flip and, and roll right there. That's your hard slap, 
and we got to really work. You can see Caitlin Lowe, how she is strong, and then she impacts and extends through and rolls much later in the swing. Uh, this time, uh, you you know, your bat head drops a little bit. You should be pulling diagonal, but you're still, you're getting your hands out in front, and this is a really nice position. And you see how you flip the bat, oh, roll your hands over right there. You know, just a little bit more work on your extension will make that hard slap a lot nicer. But you're really getting to the point of impact a lot better. You see, now this is where you really drop your bat head right here, and you see your hands are back in the middle part of your body. The red line shows your bat dropping back, and that's that's the weak bat angle. And then uh, you roll and flip your bat over, and you're just not on a very good plane to make good contact with the ball on that swing. And I, and I think that's the number one thing that you have to fight through, and I think that is for anybody uh, that's trying to learn how to slap. Watch your hands right here and your bat angle dropping down. When it, Your hands should already your, be out in front of you. And then, of course, as you get to the point of impact, you flip. And you can see your bat head above your hands. And we never want to see that bat head above the hands. And uh, there your bat head is really a little bit low and, and soft. And just needs to be a, a lot more firm and in command. A lot more attitude. And here I'm showing you, you know, that's, you look how much your bat head drops right there and how weak your wrist are. Much better, but right when you get to the point of impact, that flip over the top. So you look really good to that point of impact, but we just need to work a little bit more on our extension. We want to extend through the ball and flip and roll our wrist much later. You can see your hands rolling a little bit right here, but that's still a much better angle, and uh, even that is a is a much better looking swing. Here's your hands high and very firm, and putting the ball where you want to. So I like that little uh, bunt. Uh, that bat head dropping down right there is is too much and we want to have our hands out in front of us and and be a little bit more firm at the point of impact and i've showed that to you right there we we demonstrate right there's where we want to be so here we go again um we're a little slow to get our but our hands are out in front and we're getting ready to smack it impact and right when we get there we flip that bat head and you can see how it's up above our hands. So you're really getting to where you've got that bat drop out of the way and you're in a much better plane. We just have to finish our extension. Uh, right there, you were really firm on your soft slap. And uh, you didn't drop your bat head or like that. Here you are again. You're in great shape. You see how it's coming hard at that angle? That looks so much better so much better hands are starting to get out in front we're getting ready to whip that bat and uh, that that's still much better angle and much more firm at the point of impact not bad but right here on your hard slap point of impact and you flip and roll the bat early so on the hard slap we really gonna have to work on that extension and and rolling our wrist much later I finally give you a, a thumbs up for uh, not dropping the bat head. And that looks really nice right there. That was really nice to the, to the ball, and then you extended through. You still rolled your wrist a little bit, but uh, right there again, hands out in front, nice firm at impact. See how much nicer that looks? I mean, here as we get to the end of our day, you're really same thing look right here your bat head's not dropping you've got a much better angle your hands are out in front you're going to be really firm at the point of impact that looks really nice that really in control and putting the ball where you want to and that's three or four really good swings 
soft slap, butt slap, and a hard slap. Same thing right there. Much better bad angle. A nice soft slap right there. Hands are back. Not bad. I mean, we still flip and roll our wrist, so we'll work on that extension. Hands are high on the bat. Nice job making an impact, putting the ball where you want it. And a little too much wrist roll right there, just kind of a reminder of what we got to work on. So, our bad angle, don't drop, don't flip, better extension, those are the things. And then right here, why do I have this here? This is for attitude. Show me attitude. And attitude is not grinning from ear to ear. Attitude is letting that pitcher know that you're the one that's intimidating. You're the one that's inflicting the fear. And uh, you're going to slap on your terms. You're putting the pressure on her. You're putting the pressure on the defense.